Hi, I'm Bob Galvin, and I'm Vice President of the, of the Applied Business Unit with Global Responsibility for Applications primarily in the field of food, environmental, toxicology, and industrial characterization. I've been with Brooker for just over eight years, and it's my pleasure to update you on the new iron source, we call it VIP HESI. It stands for Vacuum Insulated Probe Heated Electrospray Source. It's also a dual source, as an APCI probe is fully integrated within it. Switch over time between the two modes is very rapid, in the order of a minute or so. The source is compatible with all our revolutionary Tim's Toff systems, as well as its existing OTOF instruments, like the Rugged Impact 2. It can be operated from low microliters per minute to about a mil per minute, with a sweet spot in the range of 250 to 700 microliters per minute. So why are we excited about this source that was launched at the Brooker at Seed meeting earlier this month? But achieving a sensitivity improvement, a factor of five or a factor of 10, is a big gain in modern mass spectrometry systems. And this is exactly what we've achieved with the design incorporated into the VIP HESI source. And these factors are demonstrated in both positive and negative iron mode, with both electrospray and APC iron modes. So it's a significant step forward in all directions. And here are some results from customer samples. In hair analysis, sensitivity gains for drugs of abuse averaged about a factor of 16, which allowed a more detailed timeline for drug usage to be created and a smaller sample length of hair could be extracted. Also in forensics, uh, drugs in urine samples exhibited a times five increase in sensitivity, which equally importantly stayed stable even after many hundreds of injections. And this level of stability is testament to the high efficiency of the active exhaust system which removed matrix from the iron source uh, after the ionization process and stops contamination. And in a similar gain, we got the factor of five was achieved in lipids in plasma in the negative iron mode. This reduced the number of false positives by improving the quality of unique lipid identification using 4D lipidomic workflows and allowed a greater number of biologically important annotations to be made. Another major application area where gains were about a factor of 10 have been demonstrated in screening workflows in environmental and food analysis, but this improvement can either be utilized in simplifying sample preparation or enabling earlier detection of emerging low-level pollutants such as PFAS or PFAS type molecules. In the latter example, using a VIP HESI source in combination with trapped high mobility spectrometry on a TIMSTOS system would allow isomers eluding a similar retention times to be separated by their collisional cross-section and thus individually characterized and quantified. This powerful combination would allow researchers in exposomics, for example, earlier and more detailed elucidation of compounds affecting the human exposome. As early data suggests, uh, a VIP HESI source and a QTOS system results in sensitivity which is on par with high end triple quadrupoles, but with added value of accurate mass and retrospective data and degradation. So all of this combined is why we're excited about the new VIP HESI source. And if you'd like further information, then please contact your local proper salesperson or visit our website. Thank you.